hello guys i'm back with a new video in this video i'm going to show you how to dirty flush a custom home um many knows and i have made it uh two to three tutorials on my website and um, and posted on youtube as well to flush uh, to how to flush a custom rom uh, based on android 8.1.0 which is available for this sort i mean the mi a1 but uh, I see a lot of people in WhatsApp, WhatsApp groups and telegram, telegram groups also. They are suffering to flush. Um, uh, I mean, they are suffering to do a dirty flush in this uh, MIA one because of the AB partition. Uh, but it's actually easy and it's it's a bit different than the the other phones. But it's easy, actually. As you can see, I have installed uh, some in apps or uh, as. Uh, I'm using this phone as a daily driver and I'm using some important apps so now I'm currently on uh, Nitrogen OS which is uh, uh, by, which is built by Abhinav uh, the, uh, he's a very great developer and uh, I, I, I want to say that uh, many users many developers uh, try to build Nitrogen OS but actually they failed I kind of say they, f I, I cannot say they failed, but uh, that they, they moved from it. They didn't try to build nitrogen after they get uh, one error. But uh, I, I really, it's really hats up to Abhinav that he, he he built it. And actually, it's a it's one of my favorite uh, room. So uh, actually, I'm I, there's no update uh, of nitrogen OS till now. So for dirty flashing, I will be showing uh, you by flashing the same ROM again. So I'm on the stop kernel of Nitrogen OS, and uh, so let's proceed. For before doing that, what you have to do is go to security and locations, go to pin, type your pin, and select it to none. After doing that, <coughs> one more important thing is, if we have installed, uh, applied any substratum themes, then you need to disable it, else it may uh, cause some uh, force closures. So it's disabled now as you can see now what you have to do is if you are on nitrogen OS custom ROM you can select advanced reboot to boot into TWRP recovery if you are not on uh, any uh, uh, on nitrogen OS or any other ROM uh, that show that that will allow you to boot into recovery directly so uh, you, you can do you can follow the uh, old processor i will do it uh, in the old processor shut your device you have after a shutdown completely you have to press power key plus volume up key to boot into recovery like a hell cut <laughs> So after it booted to TWRP recovery, what you have to do is go to wipe, go to advanced wipe. Uh, now here this thing you have to do. On flashing a custom ROM, it's uh, by clean flashing a custom ROM, you have to set, wipe Dalvi cache system and data. But in uh, Dirty Flash and MIA1, you have to do is uh, select Dalvi cache and system and swipe to wipe. After wiping it, go back, select reboot, select slot P, again go back. And reboot to be recovery. After 
after it put it to recovery again what you have to do is go to wipe go to advanced wipe select the same option and then swipe to wipe after the wipe is done what you have to do is go to install and go to the uh, go to the folder you have uh, stored your rom zip and see i have in the folder and it's uh, the same rom i'm flashing you can do this uh, you can really do this by i mean by dirty flashing a rom if your update comes select the sorry select the rom zip flash it so alive make it last forever stop in time Now finally the ROM is flushed. After uh, the ROM is flushed, go back and go again to install. Again, uh, and it's very important to flush TWRP recovery installer zip file after flushing your uh, ROM or uh, after flushing, uh, I mean after re wiping those uh, system and data partitions. So now we have to last TWRP recovery zip file to keep your TWRP permanent or else you will lose the TWRP so fine if the TWRP is installed and then it's flushed again go to uh, reboot section and again reboot to recovery After you put it to recovery, go to install and flush uh, flash gaps. Hypnotized by the sounds of breathing in hold tight, hold tight, can't make calls collide. Hold tight, hold tight, hold tight, dripping lights, paint the sky. So the gaps are finally installed. Now you can click next and do not select reboot your device now. You have to flash magic now. I'll get it finished. Unlock TWRP. Go back. Go back. Again go to install. Select the flash the magic zip file. Can make me So after 
after the magic magic the so after your magic is flushed you can just reboot your system now so let me get installed and here it is So it's booted. You can see the wallpaper is seen, the launcher is seen, and uh, nothing has been wiped. No data has been wiped. All the apps are installed. Uh, there is no problem, I guess. Yes, it, is no, it has no problems now. Okay. So in, in my in my uh, process, I have plus the same ROM. If a new build comes, it, this will work at the same, the same I have done. So if a new update comes, uh, you just follow the same procedure and you are good to go. So guys, thank you for watching. If you need any help regarding flashing ROM or my A1 or any help uh, related to technologies, and mobiles and Androids especially, I cannot help about iOS. If you, if you need any help about Android, so please leave it in the comment section below. And please do subscribe to my channel. Please do check out my website too, simpletextnow.com. And uh, do comment your reviews over there.